nature of assignment you are given as a dozer operator on a wildland fire puts you in a hazardous situation. Even though we are taught to fight fire aggressively, there is always a high priority set on safety. Before we discuss fire entrapment procedures, let us look at the required safety clothing you should have. Plastic helmet, goggles, Nomex, gloves, and the most current fire shelter. Now, if the situation happens where you might be run over by fire, follow these steps. If you do not have a safety island near you, you must build one. One of the best practices is to clear an area the flame length height times four. Face the dozer towards the oncoming fire and build a berm of dirt. You will put your dozer in the center of the cleared area. Set your blade down. Set your brakes. Set your engine speed to half throttle. Put your seat cushion up. This is a universal sign to firefighters that there is either a dozer operator under the dozer or in the nearby area. If you have an enclosed cage, close the door before leaving. Deploy your fire shelter behind the dozer. This procedure has been tested and does protect the dozer operator should he become run over by fire. We do recommend that you practice this method several times in order for it to become second nature should the situation ever arise. <laughs>